Current COVID cases in New Hampshire are taking a toll on hospital staffs. Doctors and nurses at Catholic Medical Center in Manchester say they're dealing with their most intense surge of cases since the pandemic began. If you don't need to come to the hospital, then don't come here because... It's not the place to be right now. Janelle Roy has been working with COVID patients at CMC for almost two years now. She says the current situation is the worst she's seen. I think the scariest thing on our unit is we're the step before the ICU. So, you know, we see the progression of people and we try so hard with our rapid response team. Concord Hospital is also putting emergency plans into action. We are very crowded in the ICU. However, our emergency plans do allow for what's called a surge, and we are surging those to other areas that are capable of critical care. Many of the most severe COVID cases right now are in people who are unvaccinated, but it's not just COVID cases that are crowding the hospital, and patient care remains the highest priority. We do have a high volume. Um, we are doing what we can to accommodate those patients safely. We have plans in place. Compounding the issue is the critical staffing issue that so many hospitals have been dealing with for months. The burnout and the, you know, we'll call it the compassion fatigue is just, you know, coming to work every day is definitely a struggle. National Guard troops will soon be providing some relief to help with backroom and non-essential tasks, allowing frontline workers to best manage this latest surge. I'm Nicole Lally, WMUR News 9.